Hello and welcome to your new Good Barber tutorial. Today, we'll talk about the different navigation templates. They play a crucial role in your user's experience and it's the main navigation of your app. For this tutorial, we'll use the app for our local business, the Freyaspa. To select one, go to the menu My App, Design, Navigation menu. Select the template you want to apply to your app. Each navigation template has its own characteristic and will enhance the different section of your app depending on your needs. Let's choose the slate template. It consists of three parts. My first part is the header. You can add your logo, a shortcut towards the user profile, this if you have activated the authentication add-on, other shortcuts or separator. I'm simply adding my logo. Then let's move on to the main navigation. You'll find here all the sections you selected for the main navigation in the menu My App Content sections. I also want to highlight the link toward the services offered by the spa. I click on the link Our Services and activate the option Feature this link. I change the color and voila, there's my link. All I need now is to create a footer. Like for the header, you can add links. I'm adding a link toward the user profile and toward the spa Facebook page. Now let's go to the settings menu. You can change the design of the navigation mode, the display of the logo we added earlier, the color and the background effect. the colors and font used. And finally, we configure the menu option. It display always closed or open when launching the app. I'm happy with my final design. Let me show you from the client side. This is a slate design. To give you an idea of the other versions, swipe, little swipe, tab bar, and grid. You can create your menu from scratch or deactivate the menu and simply use the home page as navigation. You now know how to set the navigation menu of your app. See you very soon for another tutorial. <laughs>